Hey everyone, welcome back to Reeling Studio. Today, we're diving into a topic that many of you have asked about, security camera troubleshooting. Specifically, we'll be tackling some frustrating issues related to SD cards. So if you're ever faced with the problem of having space left on your SD card, but getting the dreaded no recording in this month's message, you're in the right place. Have you ever met any of these issues on your security camera? The SD card has space left, but the recent playback prompt is no recording in this month. The camera stopped the motion detection recording. The camera stops recording continuously. Each of these issues can be a headache, but fear not, we're going to address them one by one and get your security camera system back to its full functionality. Firstly, ensure that the specifications of your SD card meet the requirement. FAT32 and at least Class 10. Verify that the SD card is recognized properly. If you've set your camera to record after events, ensure that the alarm type and schedule are consistent. You can check if the camera can detect events successfully by push notifications. Confirm that the override feature has been enabled. This feature ensures that your camera system automatically overrides the oldest recordings when the SD card is full so as to save space for new recordings. Now, let's do some tests. Set the recording schedule to timer and see if it works. If you've set only the alarm recording schedule and are experiencing issues, also your camera supports continuous recordings, let's try setting the recording schedule to timer and see if that resolves the problem. Access your camera settings and change the recording schedule to timer mode. This ensures that the camera recording is continuously based on a set time schedule, irrespective of alarms. Now, if you've gone through the initial troubleshooting steps and are still facing issues, the next test is to format the SD card. Formatting the SD card can help resolve any potential file system errors or corruption. Be aware that formatting will erase all data on the card, so make sure to back up any important recordings. Next, let's try upgrading to the latest firmware. Keeping your device up to date is crucial for optimal performance. If you haven't already, let's try upgrading to the latest firmware. Visit the website or use the camera system's interface to check for and install the latest firmware update. This can introduce bug fixes and improvements. Now, on to restoring and resetting the device. If everything else fails, restoring or resetting the device might be the solution. Find the restore option in your camera advanced settings or hard reset the camera by long pressing the reset button. Be cautious, as this will erase your configurations. And there you have it, troubleshooting guide for common security camera issues. I hope you found this video helpful and if you loved it, as usual, give it a thumbs up and comment down below while you're doing that. And don't forget to subscribe. Until our next video, stay safe, stay secure, see you next time.